tapping his ass. Go ahead, force the ball. Back. I like defense in this. Hey, Mike Wayne. Hey, I appreciate that, Wayne. I appreciate that, Mike. Maybe. I appreciate that, bro. You put dribbling back in the game. Uh, uh, look, you put dribbling and shooting back in the goddamn game. Yes, sir. Ha. You put it back in the game, boy. It's brass, bro. I want you to keep this same energy on the time, bro. <laughs> look at that. Shy. <laughs> Sean, you said that boy was gonna have different energy come the summertime. <laughs> oh, boy, cooking up. Oh. Bro, I'm freaking. <laughs> that boy is cooking up. He's him. He's him. Come on, chat, bro. Come on, bro. Hey. No, uh, I'm back, y'all. I'm, I'm back, bro. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Sleepy Hollows, you see that, right? You see, you see that, right? <laughs> oh yeah, boy. I'm chat. I'm t hey, chat. I'm telling y'all. Look, my Twitter is right there. I post on Twitter, right? I was telling dudes on Twitter what I was going to do. I was telling them. I was literally telling them. I was going to. <sighs> Chill back in the bill, man. What's good, YouTube, man? It's chilly, just yeah, chill, man. You already know the vibes, man. If it's your first time tuning in to me, man, make sure, you know what I'm saying? Well, first off, welcome, welcome. My name is Chilly, you feel me? And on second of all, you know what I'm saying? I know I'm not going to tell y'all to hit the sub button just yet, but at least hit the like button. It's free, right? It's free to hit the like button. It's free to support. That's all you got to do, and let's get to everything else I got to talk about. 
So today, man, hey, I'm on a 1v1 court. Now, I told y'all I would bring y'all a 1v1 court video with my 6'8 five-way superstar build, my 6'8 post playmaker build, my Thanos build, right? And I just wanted to talk more about this build because I feel like it's the best build in the game. Now, I haven't been able to really play 2K, um, you know, in the past week. Um, this all came from the first weekend of the game. So I played that Saturday. Like, you know, the game came out on the 9th and it was that Friday. So I played on the 10th played. And then I, I played a little bit throughout that first week a little bit, but not really. Um, and a lot of y'all, y'all, as y'all know, it is week two. And, um, you know, the game's been out for two weeks now. About two weeks, right? We're on Thursday. And, um, yeah, you know what I'm saying? They've been doing a lot of things with the game. I heard they've been messing up a lot of stuff. They've been patching a few things. They've been maybe fixing a little few things. But we don't know what the dev team got in store for us in the coming future. You know, 2K23 started off extremely great and ended up becoming one of the worst 2Ks that we've ever received. It's been the trashest 2K. Now, 2K23 was, you know, fun at some times. You know, it was, you know, for me personally, because I didn't even play the game like that. So every time I came on, you know what I'm saying, I, you know, was just cooking up, doing what I was doing. But overall, the game was trash. It was very rocky. It was, had no paint defense eventually. You know, even if I had a high interior and a high block, I had a build that had a 99 block. Hall of Fame anchor with 6'9 and a max 7'6 wingspan with an 88 interior. And I was over here getting tossed up, just laid up in the paint, bro. So I know the game is real rocky. So hopefully, you know, they fix the things that needs to be fixed. They address the things that needs to be addressed um, correctly and not just any type of way. And, um, you know, hopefully it's a good year, bro. But, like I said, you know, I ain't been playing the game, so I'm going to get back to it soon, probably this weekend. I might give y'all a stream tomorrow on Friday. Uh, expect the stream possibly on uh, 6, like 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time or maybe even 7. But I'll let y'all know in the Discord. My Discord is in the description. Um, or if y'all can't find it or the, if the link happens to not work, don't hesitate to ask in the comments and I'll give y'all the Discord link. I'll let y'all know in the Discord when I'm a stream. And, uh, you know, just keep them noties on, right? Sub and keep them noties on. Or for the ones who's already sub, keep them noties on, put them noties on. Uh, if they're not working, because sometimes YouTube be tripping, uh, just take the noti button off and then turn it back on, right? The little bell icon. Um, but yeah, I mean, like, we're gonna go crazy. You know, I love this build, man. This build does everything. It's like I said, 6'7. I mean, I'm sorry, 6'8, a 6'10. Boom, I could post hook easy. He get pro touch on Hall of Fame, right? So you'll see me doing a lot of post hooks, right? Because that's what I can do, right? I get hook specialist Hall of Fame, pro touch Hall of Fame. You know what I'm saying? In this game, I don't really care for dunking. So you, you will never see me dunk with this build because he doesn't have a dunk rating. Um, just go check out my last two videos. I done posted the build video. But I might remember to post the build video in the description or something. Or somebody just asked in the comment section. But yeah, I made the build with no dunk. But he has a high layup. He has a good layup. A 70 layup. and But I be going stupid with it. Especially with that bulldozer badge. Um, and you know what I'm saying? I got a high standing dunk, right? I got an 81 standing dunk, so I can back dudes down all the way to the paint uh, 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 with that 96 strength. Boom, I put physicals takeover on, or I get my gym rat, you know what I'm saying? The little gym rat um, badge or whatever, you know, you get your Gatorade, your workouts for the week. Boom, that's like plus four to your physicals or whatever. Boom, I basically got a 99 strength. So basically, you know, all I got to do is play post score, really. I can play post score on this build. So if you feel like one day just being toxic and playing post score on the build, you can do that. He can back dudes down. He can spin off people, right? I got that postman technician hall of fame, right? And then you grab you a stretch teammate or a spot up somewhere, and boom, you have that post playmaker badge. I get it on silver, right? Boom, that's easy works, right? I'm always a mismatch. That's why every single year I love having a player that's a mismatch. That's a big guard. That's a big dribbler. No matter what year, I always do this. No matter what, I don't care if the meta last year was 6'9. I was already going to make a 6'9. I made a 6'9 day one because I knew what I was going to do. I always make tall, mismatched dribbling builds that can baby the little guards 
as well as punish them bigs because of my quickness, right? Because I'm a point forward type of build, <laughs> you feel me? So, yeah, that's what I be doing. 79 three-pointer. Boy, I've been saying, man, I've been speaking with that. And also, it's common knowledge now. You only need about a 76 to 79 to really grain in this game to really go crazy, right? And even with a high three-pointer, them shooting slumps I hear and, you know, nobody, it's green or miss. So if you make your shots, if you know your shot, you know your shot, right? My dribbling immaculate, right? So I could just play like a regular point four. I dribble like it's 2K17, bro. I love these cigs. Hey, look out for my cigs video soon. I'm going to be making a cigs video. Uh, Cause my cigs, I put these on day one. I didn't watch any other YouTuber. I didn't watch nobody make no freaking cigs videos. And I, I looked at the cigs in the animation store, and I seen I liked it, it looked good, and I put them on, and I just started going crazy with them. Simple as that. So I could play like a regular guard, right? I can play like a regular big guard, but except I can post score, right? I can. I'm literally a post scoring ISO ball handler. <laughs> like this shit's toxic. Like I literally made this build. In 2K22 next gen, and dudes did not know what to do with me. Just go check the videos out. Just go check all the content I made on 2K22 next gen. I was going crazy with my post playmaker build there too, right? I had it, except he couldn't post hook. He couldn't do like some of the spin stuff. But I was backing dudes down, going crazy, mismatch, super fast for the tall, for the bigs guarding me, super, super freaking OP and strong against the little guards that would play against me. It was ridiculous. You know what I'm saying? My defense immaculate. You know what I'm saying? I got an 88 interior defense, right? I got a 79 block. So, man, that paint should be locked, right? Post scores galore. They've been doing some things on me in this 1v1 quad. I would not lie. But best believe, when I play more of them and I get my badges, oh, it's going to be crazy. I get uh, gold posts a lot now. Um, this video is about to end, so I just wanted to see y'all, show y'all, you know, how this video, this build was doing on the 1v1 court. Uh, I'll bring y'all a ton of content on this build this year, so just stay tuned, bro. Uh, if y'all like the little montage I put at the beginning, I just wanted to show y'all a little few clips and stuff like that, man. I appreciate y'all, man. You know what I'm saying? Oh, one more thing I wanted to mention is the strength is crazy. Back down Punisher Hall of Fame. I had to mention that. A movable enforcer Hall of Fame. Physical handles Hall of Fame. Bulldozer Hall of Fame. Bro, this is the best ultimate ISO post build you can make, bro. I'm telling you, it's unpatchable. For real, bro. And, bro, it's, it's amazing build. I'm going to bring you a lot more content on this build soon. Stay tuned, man. And I appreciate y'all, man. I'll see y'all in the next video, bro.